introduce the way of life and culture of the First Nations of the Snohomish people here. The headdress, however, is real. He actually visited the prairies and was given the most, the highest present that anyone could ever be given in those times. Now, that is actually a chieftain's headdress. It is considered a crown. So he was given that with the highest respect. So not only did he use it and wear it as an icebreaker for tourists, but he also wore it with pride and honor and respect for the peoples of the prairies. Now we're going to fast forward to the final two owners of the bridge.